Subtle signs that your girlfriend wants to break up with you. Subtle signs that your girlfriend wants to break up. She wants to break up, like she's tired. She can't do it anymore. These are signs for you to know that that girl you're dying for, she's tired. She don't want to do anymore. So let me just tell you so that you start seeing these signs before your heart will now go and scar her. So make sure you stay at the end of this video because I have five signs to let you know that your girlfriend is on the edge on the verge on the edge five signs to know that your girlfriend wants to break up with you so keep watching hi my name is ij welcome to my youtube channel here we talk about love sex and relationship and we focus mostly on the men because we are trying to teach them how to understand women and choose the best woman for themselves okay so today we're talking about five signs that your girlfriend wants to break up with you five sub to so not sub to sub to but like five signs that the girl you're, you're with is fed up and she wants to break up with you and the first thing that happens in this case is communication stops we should be very obvious by the way but i don't know for some of you, you just pretend like you don't see these red flags and then at the end of the day boom you eat breakfast and you start crying you understand in nigeria we say breakfast they've served you breakfast that means someone has broken up with you in case you, you didn't get that yeah that's what i mean by eat breakfast so yeah so when you're when she breaks your heart and then you start saying you start seeing all of these signs all of a sudden that sound is my room fresh now so communication stops the the constant communication the openness you know the i'll be here i'm going here hanging out with friends i'm doing this i'll be back at two at two o'clock i will do this you know that normal updates you guys give each other in the relationship it stops now you no longer know where she is what she's doing what time she'll be back from work what time she's going to come see you if she's going to cook if she's going to do laundry nothing you don't know what's happening in the family you don't know anything about her the whole communication the calls the texts the chats everything stops and sometimes she's gonna make excuses like oh work is very tiring oh i'm so busy but the thing is nobody's ever really too busy for someone they care about if they care about you they're gonna make out time to talk to you to call you is not going to take them more than three minutes to do so i don't think even if they're a medical doctor uh, okay maybe in three minutes somebody may die yeah but what I'm, saying, what I'm trying to say is they can squeeze out time from their schedule to talk to you so when communication stops or really really slows down then and you complain and she acts like she, she she didn't even notice that communication stopped or she didn't even feel it that yeah you guys don't talk any don't talk often as much you get if she reacts like that like come on but we still talk like <laughs> yeah that's one of the signs that she's getting tired and she wants to break up secondly she no longer wants to hang out with you and her friends or you and your friends like she wants to hang out but she doesn't want you in that circle she, she no longer wants you in that space with her close friends i mean before it used to be normal that you guys would go out together you would chill with your friends and her friends i mean you guys would be together and all that but right now she only wants to chill with her friends she no longer wants you in that circle she no longer wants to hang out with you she only wants to hang out with her friends or with your friends without you being in the circle then just know she's trying to cut you off already that's a very big sign i don't even know why you guys don't see this i mean if your girlfriend is always excited to go out with you and then all of a sudden she's like mm, don't worry i'm fine mm, don't worry i'm fine or oh babes you're going there can i join you guys she's like oh no no it's okay it's fine we'll be back so we'll be back soon if she starts to push you out of the circle out of her her circle then she's telling you that i don't want you in this space anymore or i think i don't want you in this space anymore so it's the same thing so if your girlfriend is cutting you out of her circle and no longer wanting to hang out with you then i think you should pay attention to that because that's a very big sign that she is falling out of love with you thirdly the connection or chemistry changes or disappears you know when you start a new relationship with someone there's this bond there's this connection there's this chemistry I mean you guys complete each other's sentences you guys want to always be together you guys do things in sync you guys understand things in sync and all of a sudden it's like that chemistry is fading it's like all of those excitement is no longer there it's like you guys are in the same room but 
it's like it's like it's empty you still you feel like something is missing all of those jumping around and playing around and baby fights and all of those happy times it just stops and even when you guys try to you know make this happy create this happy moment it just nigerians will say it doesn't gel it doesn't blend anymore it doesn't it doesn't even feel right it's like you're not forcing this chemistry now when you notice this about your girl when you notice that the whole excitement on her side is stopping and she's not giving you that vibe anymore you know that connection that chemistry that used to be there how she used to grab everything even before you say it and she grabs it but now it's like she doesn't even pay attention to all of that anymore it's like she does it's like she's not present anymore the whole bond the whole connection the whole chemistry is just it's like you you are the one forcing this happy times forcing yourself to create this happy you know these happy moments and you clearly see that you're the one forcing it because you can't lie to yourself if the chemistry disappears you definitely feel it so sometimes she's going to give excuses like oh i'm so tired oh i'm stressed or oh, really she might act distracted pay attention if the chemistry is not there you will feel it and then that's a sign that she's getting tired she's getting fed up and that is it the fourth thing here is she withholds sex. Duh. If a girl withholds sex, except it's a spiritual thing, maybe she wants to go celebrate or it's just a spiritual journey. That's if you guys have been having sex, you understand? If you guys are sexually active in the relationship, so I mean. So if she decides to just withhold sex, then brother. Brother. Why? It's either she's done with you or she's having it with some other person because like I understand that sometimes a woman might not be in the mood to have sex Okay, sometimes she's stressed because for us women we need to put our mind and our body into that sex If not, it's going to feel like you're raping us. So if our mind and our body is not, it's not in that sex, it doesn't feel good So sometimes we are going to complain. Oh, I'm tired. I'm not in the mood. Please. I don't want to have sex right? I have so much going on in my mind, but when it becomes a norm for her when it becomes a one week, two weeks, one month, two months, three months thing and she keeps withholding sex. <laughs> she's trying to let you know that I can't be doing this with you. I can't be doing this with you. Not everybody knows how to, you know, tell you that <laughs> this is not going to work. So sometimes they give you these signs just to give you hints that I don't want to do this anymore with you. Because, I mean... For a relationship that's sexually active, I don't think there's any reason to withhold sex. I mean, you could get angry with your bae and you want to withhold, self for, withhold sex for a day or two. But when it gets to like one week, two weeks, one month, bro, she's not having it with you, she's having it with somebody else. Especially if you know your girl is someone who's sexually active and who is who is who is who loves sex. Let's put it that way. If you know your girlfriend enjoys having sex and she keeps giving you excuses, weeks, months bro she's having sex some other place and maybe that's just her way of telling you see i don't have sex with you anymore so why can't you read in between the lines and know that we are done so if she withholds sex you need to pay attention it could be a sign that she's done now the last thing on my list today is she fights with you for the smallest things like she picks up fights for the littlest things she she looks for the smallest things to fight about so she can just get out from your from your space okay so that she can just walk out or shun you for days so she can do whatever she wants to do this is a trick a lot of girls use so if you notice that your girlfriend is always picking little fights with you so that you guys don't talk for two three days she's trying to create space to see some other person that's just what i feel and i know <laughs> okay so if she picks up fight for the smallest things like for instance um you you want to watch tv you want to watch football and she wants to watch a movie and you're like no let me watch it like you're like let me watch the let me watch the football then you can watch the movie later and she's like no you're always fond of this you don't let me watch whatever i want to watch she's like you know what fine you can have the whole house to yourself watch all your tv watch all of this i'm going to stay in my friend's house and then she leaves and you're like totally make it make sense Okay, if she fights for the smallest things that could have just been resolved with, okay, baby, sorry, but she wants to make it a big deal because she wants to get out of your space. So you see, if a girl acts this way, acts all crazy for the smallest things, then you need to pay attention and if it's a regular thing, if it's something that you know this doesn't happen before, and all of a sudden this is a habit that she's, you know, putting up and she's always looking for a way to fight and be on her own and be in her own space, then it's that she's 
talking to someone she's always chatting with someone or she's already seen someone so you need to pay attention so this is the end of the video for today thank you so much for staying with me please be sure to click on the notification bell here subscribe to my channel share this video give this video a thumbs up i will see you next time if you haven't seen any of our videos make sure you check the description box i'll be dropping some links to my other videos i will see you next time stay loved stay beautiful and bye for now mm -hmm.